I'm out here with Brad people. He's wanting to learn how to fly fish, so we're working on our loop here in the backyard. Let's get it down pretty quick. Okay, I'm laying it down. What? Wanted to learn how to tie. I talked to Ty and he said, hey, come over and I'll show you, you know, show you a few things, show you, show you what I do and kind of how to get started. So I come over and he spent about an hour with me showing me, you know, the basics, how to, how to lay a bed and... People got Brad here, we're uh, learning how to tie flies. What do you think? We got enough there? That's it. Cool. You can just cut that little tag end off the back okay. just to clean it up. And we're talking about uh, Sally Hansen hard as nails. I'm, I'm rocking the wet, wet and wild right now because I couldn't find any at Walmart. But when Sally Hansen's available, I get it, man. All right, Brad's kicking booty on this custom fly here. All right, we forgot the weed guard, so he's going <laughs> to put in a weed guard. But hey, look, man, that thing's turning out good. Well, Brad's been killing him behind the house here on the old fly rod. He's new to the game, but he caught on quick. Yeah, how about that? <laughs> and uh, it works. He it works. A bunch the of fish, fish approved. The other day, Holy yeah. smokes. I took it out for the first time, and I think I did three reds, a black, and a little bass out in the marsh was, all in about three hours. So nuts, it works. Man. It was cool. TFO Mangrove Coast 8 weight. And then the reel. Lamps and liquid. Lamps and liquid. All right, we're going to hit the marsh here, folks. We're going to hit the uh, probably the Mangrove Islands, do some sight casting. I think Tracy's coming with us today. It's a Cajun uh, fly line repellent. Got it on the old TMB fly. Is that a trout? Like a little redfish. Oh, All right, power pull down. Drop the reel and everything. Man, Coming undone. total chaos. <laughs> All right. Tied that one in the shed, boy. All right, Bradley. Good job, man. The blind casting, man. Trying to hit throwing, these little holes. Throwing the potholes, huh? Yeah. Yeah, so when we're not seeing fish, he's just throwing potholes. It's super smart. It's just a good structure. You can see him right here. That's a better fish. Yeah, it is. Good guy. But fish are just strong right now. Yeah, cool. Look at that fly is just producing like crazy, man. You know? Usually takes people months to get a decent loop going to where they can fish a little bit. Brad's picking this up fast, man. We're throwing in the wind today. Love it. Yeah, so cool. Now you see him. I don't know. I, I, I can't see where he's at now. I think he's coming back to the left. I thought you had. Brad is waiting for a fish to, he can see to throw at, but when he's not seeing him, he's throwing potholes and structure and he's hanging fish left and right. No big ones yet, but they're getting bigger. That one's a little bigger. Well, there's something magical about creating your own fly and then presenting it to a fish and actually getting that fish to eat. It's just an amazing process.
job, bud. Yeah. Fantastic, man. All right, we just still on one island, got three or four of them, and uh, we're gonna keep on rolling. Got a nice little drift. So what's going on back there on the platform? I hung a nice fish. He's a running. I don't know if I can get him in. Woo-wee, he's yeah. a good one. Oh, and yeah. boom. <laughs> We're supposed to be filming fly fishing later. Huh? Let me catch a fish. If we can no. Fly. You need to knock it off, Teresa. So here Brad and I are trying to film a pure fly fishing episode. And we got this stowaway on the boat that keeps hanging stuff left and right. So I always got to show up. All right, catch the fish. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Teresa Show. And here she goes again. Poor Brad, don't have a chance. Well, you said to get a big one. <laughs> I said for him to get a big one, you keep catching all his fish. I didn't Never know bring him. It was behind him, it was not in front of him. You can pull some of that real outdoor channel stuff. I was fishing behind him, not in front of him. Yeah, that's what they all say when they bring a spinning rod. <laughs> Talking about there's a school. There was. There was a couple with him and they went off that way. Got it on the AM lure? That's a good one, honey. Man, geez, that's like a 23. Right, I couldn't reach him anyway. Good <laughs> Excuse me, Not, That's more than 23. That's a good fish. How much? 25. Dang. Pig one, man. Well, that's it, buddy. You have fun? I have a blast, man. <laughs> She's tired from catching all the fish today. Oh, we shouldn't have brought you. <laughs> Glad she was here. At least you got to see a big one today. <laughs> I'd like to congratulate Brad on all the fish he's been catching lately, picking up the fly rod recently, and just killing it. What a fun boat. Hey, if you'd like to learn to fly cast, if you'd like to do some fly fishing in general, either on kayak or flat skiff, just give me a shout. All the information's at 30milesout.com. We'll catch you later. What? <laughs>